Begin in a comfortable seated position. Tilt the pelvis forward. Spine is long. Head is slightly back. Collarbones are broad. Breathe in through the nose, filling up the lungs with as much air as you can. And as you exhale, emptying out the lungs, drawing the navel in towards the spine. With each exhale, feel yourself become more present on the mat. Bring your hands down. Inhale, lift the arms up, look up. Exhale, arms come down, chin to chest, spine is long. Inhale, arms lift up, look up. Exhale, arms float down, chin towards chest. Inhale, arms lift, fingers are spread. Exhale, chin to chest. Inhale, arms come up, look up. Exhale, shoulders into the torso. Send right arm forward, left arm back, slight twist. Looking out over to your left. Arms are engaged, fingers are spread evenly. Inhale, lift arms, look up. Exhale, left arm forward, right arm back. Slight twist. Imagining that you're wringing out your stomach like you're wringing out a wet washcloth. So you're initiating the twist from the stomach. Inhale, arms come up overhead, look up. Exhale, arms out in front. Bring the hands together to interlace the fingers, round the back, lower chin to chest. Breathe in between the shoulder blades. You can move the arms up and down gently if that feels good for you, whatever you need to do in order to open up the upper back. On the next inhale, release the hands, bringing the heart forward, hands come back behind you. Gentle stretch for the chest. Exhale, round the back. Interlace the fingers, drop the chin towards the chest. Inhale, open up, heart comes forward. Exhale, round the back, chin toward chest. Inhale, open up, heart comes forward. Exhale, round the back, chin toward chest. Inhale, open up, heart reaches forward. Exhale, round. Inhale, open. Exhale, round. And bring the hands down. Bring both feet on the mat. I'm gonna turn so you can see better. Both feet are on the mat, not one on top of the other. Inhale, right arm comes up overhead. Exhale, lean over, opening up the side body, making sure both hips stay plugged into the ground. Arm is straight, looking up. Shoulder is away from the ear, breathing fully and deeply. Inhale, come to center. And from here, we'll begin to roll the shoulders. Just warming up the upper body two more times. On the next inhale, bring the left arm up. Exhale, shoulder down away from the ear. Inhale, come up and over the body. Arm is straight and strong. Fingers are engaged. You're looking up if that feels okay for the neck and the hips are plugged into the mat. As you breathe, think about making space in between the ribs and the intercostal muscles. Breathing fully and mindfully. Inhale, come to center. 
Bring the hands in towards the shoulders, elbows out in front of you. On the next inhale, look up as you draw the elbows up towards the sky and make big circles with the elbows. Move with the pace of your breath. From here, bring the elbows out in front in reverse direction. And last time. Let the hands come down. Bring the arms out to the side. Bring the left arm in towards the chest. And bring the right hand to the left forearm. Breathe into any areas of tightness. Open up the arms. Draw right arm in towards the chest. Use the left hand on the right forearm. Keep the shoulder blades drawing toward each other, spine is long, pelvis tilted forward. Inhale, release the pose. Look down and make sure that you are not seated like this, with one foot on top of the other. You want both legs on the mat, one in front of the other. Bring the fingertips down. Inhale, get as long as you can. Exhale, come forward just a little bit. With each exhale, try to melt forward even more. I'm going to turn so you can see better. You want to keep the hips plugged into the mat. Don't let them lift off the mat. Bring the heart forward instead of rounding the back. On the next inhale, release the pose. Bring the hands behind you. Gently push into the hands, lifting the pelvis, lifting the heart up, letting the head go back if that's okay for your neck. Opening up the whole front body with this gentle stretch. Exhale, release. And from here, we're going to go over to the other side. To do that, you need to bring the other foot in front. Bring the hands down in front of you, fingertips on the ground. Tilting the pelvis forward. As you inhale, get the spine long. And as you exhale, melt forward, thinking about drawing your heart forward. Scan the body for any areas of tension and bring breath into those areas. Inhale, sit up. As you exhale, bring the bottoms of the feet to touch, preparing for Baddha Konasana. Bring your feet as close to your pelvis as you can. If you're really tight, your feet may be out here like this. That's totally fine. Wherever you need to be is fine. Take the thumbs into the arches of the feet. And press the thumbs in, opening up the feet like a book. If your elbows reach your legs, use your elbows to push the legs down, drawing them towards the ground. And as you inhale, find length from the tailbone all the way through the head. And as you exhale, bring the heart forward. 
drawing the upper body down towards the ground. You can move side to side if that feels good for you. Just working on opening up the hips and the groins here. On the next inhale, release the pose. Gently bring the hands underneath the knees and close the knees. Come to the top of your yoga mat. Bring the arms out in front of you. Remove the flesh underneath the hips. So the bones, the sits bones are plugged into the ground. Lean back. Long spine, you don't want to be rounding here like this. You want the heart lifted, shoulder blades drawing toward each other. Inhale, come onto the toes. Fingers are activated. Beginning to wake up the abdominals here as you lean back. Picturing the body as the letter V. For more of a challenge, lift the right foot, spread the toes. Remember you're on your left toes here, so if your left heel is off the ground. Exhale, right foot down, inhale, left foot lifts. Spread the toes. Exhale, left foot down. Inhale, open up the knees, bring the heart forward, look up. As you exhale, close the knees, round the back, straight arms. Inhale, sit up. Arms come out in front. Come onto your toes. Shoulder blades draw toward each other, broad collarbones. Heart is lifted. Inhale, right foot lifts. Exhale, left foot lifts. Squeeze the knees together. If you need more of a challenge, extend the legs, spread the toes, use your core. Exhale, release. And lower all the way down. Bring the arms up overhead, extend the legs out, get really long from your fingertips all the way through your toes. Inhale, bring the hands down to the hips, tilt the pelvis back so the low back is glued to the mat. Bend the knees and invite the knees to come towards the chest. Hug the knees in to release the low back tension. Begin to rock side to side if that feels good. Draw your chin in towards your chest for a long spine. Come to stillness. On the next inhale, bring the hands to the knees, open up the knees. Activate the feet. So the feet are flexed. With each exhale, feel the knees draw toward the mat. Feel your body very heavy. 